You know, anything you can do positive for the community is always, you know, and to encourage other people to do stuff. It's the way to do it. You never know there's that kid, there's a kid sitting at home watching TV saying, I don't have to be ashamed of who I am. I can be out there. I can, I can change the world just by being out there and loving somebody. How does it feel to you? Well, I'm excited because I guess I'll, I'll get drink tickets. Yes. Well, I, I think they're going to find out they picked on the wrong group at last. Um, we don't take this stuff lying down. You know, we're, we're slow and steady, but we win our wars. And, you know, the biggest war for LGBT rights was just being seen as a civil right. When I was a kid, we weren't seen as a civil right. When I was a kid, we were still listed as a disease with the American Medical Association. We won those wars, and now it's these little battles. And around the and winning the, these battles around the world, which is why we're so glad he's here with us tonight. Congratulations. We're gonna yeah. get married and we're gonna have a lovely gay wedding. Yeah. Right here at this church. Yes. Yeah. All right, man. Yeah. 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 It's tough, but I, but I, the positive the positive side is communities getting together, it's reconnecting. It's um, being there for the, you know, just praying for the victims and their families and just being connected to what happened and also to remind us we're very fortunate still to be alive and it's our job to keep uh, pushing the envelope so everybody can be equal, everybody can be free, everybody can be safe. Well, the Democrats tried and the... The, the Republicans closed session, so I don't know. I, I love John Lewis. Uh, what an icon and trying to do that sit-in uh, and, and the other Democrats trying with all their heart and minds. Uh, something has to happen, though. What, what really gets me crazy with Congress, and not all of them, but most of them care about elections and them winning. What we need to care about now is about the American people and who who elected them and I don't I think that's I don't think that happens anymore I think all they care about is getting elected maybe maybe we should have shorter terms maybe they should only have a maximum of three terms can't be there until they're 108 I don't know There's, but we've got to do something well I mean my older brother's gay and my cousin's gay and I was born on the anniversary of civil rights and the death of Jimmy Carl, so I had it coming um, by the way, I know you are from Wicked. Just it adds a kind of drama that otherwise wouldn't be here, but it's more important than ever that we do pay attention. We have reason to take on gun violence. You know, the violence against LGBT people is very real. Um, and, and, and I hope that after we've finished mourning that we will use our collective voice and the power behind this community to actually take it on in a real way, along with me mental health issues. Um, I think they go hand in hand, and I think as a community we're, we're capable of, do of doing that. I'm joking off. You seem <laughs> you're like I'm just trying to relate. Um. Well, usually when you go to events, you think about like, oh my god, what am I gonna wear? I want to look pretty. I was like, no, I don't care. I'm wearing rainbow to represent the LGBT community. Um. You know, obviously what happened in Orlando is disgusting and awful. So. I just really wanted to show my support, so you know I got my rainbow as much as I can. Um, you know my best friend's here, who's gay, um, so you just gotta show your support and know that this isn't gonna happen. Like we can't let this happen. It really 
it's a humongous honor to have been asked to do a tribute um, for Orlando. I was, like the rest of the world, completely shocked and devastated. And the fact that I get to share music tonight, songs that I wrote when I was hurting, it's amazing. I hope that I get to spread just a little bit of light. I think she got over it, but um, yeah. she definitely she's, over it. she's dealt with like she was. Yeah. Um, how's your hot husband? I mean, that's like my type. Like, hot, daily.